Today we are learning more about the woman police say opened fire inside YouTube's California headquarters. Her father says he tried to warn authorities. He says his daughter was upset because she believed YouTube was censoring her videos. WBZ's Anna Myler has the latest now at noon. San Bruno police say 39-year-old Nassim Agdam shot three people inside the YouTube headquarters in California Tuesday and then turned the gun on herself. The sound of bullets sent employees running for their lives. Gunfire at YouTube. I'm calling 911. We heard like... You know. Agdam's father tells CBS Los Angeles his daughter was an animal rights activist who frequently used YouTube for her cause. He says she was angry because the company had stopped paying for content she posted online. So I'm being discriminated and filtered on YouTube, and I'm not the only one. Agdam's father says she had been missing for several days. When police located her in a car near the YouTube headquarters, he says he warned them about her complaints that YouTube was ruining her life. I know that she was reported missing in San Diego. I know that she was located in Mountain View. I understand those things. Um, beyond that, I don't know how the other information that's out there was relayed um, or received um, and, and how that was transmitted. It, it obviously, um, you know, we obviously did not have that information. Officials say on Tuesday, Nassim Agdam used a 9 millimeter handgun to shoot three people at YouTube. Police say there's no evidence Agdam knew the victims or that any of them were specifically targeted. Anna Myler, WBZ News.